Hi folks, and welcome back to Worst Off-Grid Places to Live. I'm Jesse Ivey, and today we are going to travel to the state of California, and we're going to be looking at Siskiyou County, California. So uh, why would you not want to uh, try an off-the-grid lifestyle in Siskiyou County, California? Well, there's about three reasons, and we're going to go over those right now. Siskiyou County, California is lo located on the uh, California and Oregon border. Uh, it's just right in the northern part of California. Uh, it's a beautiful uh, county, uh, but there are some things that are concerning. Now, the first reason you wouldn't want to uh, try to live off the grid uh, in Siskiyou County, California is because of the price of the land. Siskiyou County, California's land is pretty expensive, especially if you're uh, comparing it to San Bernardino County or Kern County. Um, but the land, uh, the prices, the price per acre that you're going to pay uh, to purchase land there, uh, you're not going to get a lot of land for your uh, money, basically. Uh, it's pretty expensive, and over the last few years, prices have really risen in this area in Siskiyou County. Although uh, the landscape is pretty, there usually is trees, uh, there's a lot of, uh, you know, lakes and streams nearby, uh, but the price per acre that you pay on land as you're looking here, uh, you just pay quite a bit of money and it's really uh, wouldn't be advisable to buy land here for that reason. Uh, that would be the first reason uh, that uh, buying land in Siskiyou County wouldn't be advisable is because it's expensive. Now, reason number two uh, not to live off the grid in uh, Siskiyou County, California would be uh, for the reason of there's a lot of black market illegal grow operations in this county. Um, I've had experience with that myself in that uh, a lot of these illegal grow operations operate, uh, they could be even next door to you and you're unaware of it. So if you have purchased land in uh, Siskiyou County, California, and you're thinking about even buying a house, you just definitely want to make sure the neighborhood isn't full of illegal grows uh, because a lot of these illegal grows get busted by uh, Siskiyou County uh, Sheriff's Department and they bring in the DEA and do a lot of drug raids and that type of thing. That's something that, uh, as you're seeing in these articles and stuff, that has went on uh, over the last few years because California is really cracking down on the illegal grow operations. So uh, that's another thing that you wouldn't want to uh, live next door to or be if you're live, trying to live off the grid, that would be something that would be concerning. So make sure that when you're investigating properties, you do not have any illegal marijuana grows by your house or you may be getting uh, visits or federal officers going across your property. So that's another reason um, I wouldn't advise off the grid living in Siskiyou County, California. And finally, the final reason that I wouldn't advise off-the-grid living in Siskiyou County, California would be Siskiyou County's government. Um, they are not uh, off-the-grid friendly folks. Um, they uh, have a lot of rules and in uh, 217 they enacted a, a new policy that really limits uh, what you can do. In fact, uh, you basically can't camp on your property a very long, even if you own it. So let's say you buy a piece of land in um, Siskiyou County, California, and you sit there and you decide that you want to, uh, you know, go out on your property or go camping on your property for a long period of time. Uh, maybe even start setting up shop there. Well, you really can't do that because of the fact that Siskiyou County uh, will make you put in a septic and a water source. Uh, they also only have um, camping day limits of two weeks at a time then you have to go in and get a permit for the first two weeks come back out get a permit for the second two weeks as you can see this uh, that I've got right off the Siskiyou County um, website and uh, then uh, you can only camp on your own land for 30 days a year even if it's your land that you own so that's another reason that I don't advise off the grid living in Siskiyou County. Uh, you will get a visit from code enforcement and the sheriff. They are strict. This is one of the strictest counties in California in regards to this. In 
in regards to off the grid living. So if you think you're just going to pull your uh, RV up there and start living there, you'll get a visit from code enforcement and the sheriff really fast. Uh, it doesn't take long. Neighbors tell on you or fink on you and basically you will be asked to leave. So uh, that's another reason that I would not advise off the grid living in Siskiyou County, California because they are very, very strict. Uh, they don't mess around and they will fine you and you could even get arrested. Well, folks, that's it for today. I hope you've enjoyed uh, this show and we will be back again with another episode of Worst Off the Grid Places to Live very soon. This is Jesse Ivey signing off from the Owner Terms Land Network.